Local news about local people. This is Newslink Indiana. Good evening, I'm Chris Bavender. Thanks for joining us. Governor Joe Kernan spent his holiday at Labor Day picnics and parades around the state, including a stop in Anderson. People gathered Athletic Park in Madison County today to hear not only the governor, but Senator Evan Bayh speak. Bayh talked about his Get Tough on Trade Act he will present to legislators tomorrow. Kernan says Labor Day weekend marks the start for the real campaign. This is a time, I think, when people will be focusing on the issues that are important to them and making up their minds about who they're going to vote for. And I trust their judgment. After Anderson, the governor headed to Fort Wayne and Elkhart. Over the last few years, the Portland Country Club's debt has topped $440,000. That's why it's now up for sale to potential bidders. Newslink Indiana's Derek Tucker spoke with course members about what this means for them. With a 186 to 6 vote, shareholders put the Portland Country Club up for sale. The club has lost money the past few years. Board President Fred Dehoff says Mother Nature is a main factor in the club's debt. Last year, the club lost 27 days to flooding. Dehoff says the decision to sell the club is heart wrenching. Been here since uh, oh, the mid 70s, and, and back in those days, we did a lot of the stuff ourselves. I think I've virtually built every cart and walking bridge. A former board president who now spends four to five days a week at the club says it's inevitable the course will be sold. My only hope is that the person that buys it is a golf lover and wants to see it even be a better course because it is a good course for this area. Dion says green fees, businesses and donations make up the majority of the club's income. Dehoff says portions of this Portland Country Club's golf course like this bridge have been donated by family members. Dion says competition from courses in the surrounding area have also impacted the club's debt. Golfers decide where to play. The Lakeview Country Club in Eaton says business is down around 13 percent this year, while the Winchester Country Club says business is up for this year. In Portland, Derek Tucker, Newslink, Indiana. Fred Dehoff says the club hopes to strike a deal and have the facility sold by November 1st. Now here's a look at the Newslink Indiana forecast. Tonight there is a 30% chance of rain and thunderstorms mainly before midnight, partly cloudy skies with a low of 63. Tuesday a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms with partly cloudy skies and a high of 79. And that's Newslink Indiana. Join us at 1057 tonight for more news and get local news about local people 24 hours a day at newslinkindiana.com.